Recently, one of our explorers had the opportunity to use this knowledge when she encountered a burglary that occurred at her uh, parents' vehicle while they were attending church. She then was at home, got notified that somebody had stolen their garage door remote. And my parents called, um, more specifically my mom, she called and told me that our van had been broken into at church and that our garage door opener and our uh, registration had been taken from the vehicle. And um, so she told me to make sure that all the doors and windows were locked and shut um, just for safety reasons. So I was going around making sure everything was closed and I heard uh, loud knocking and um, the doorbell being rung many times. And um, so I went to go see who it was and I didn't recognize the man. So I had kind of a bad feeling about it and took note of his uh, description, physical appearance, everything like that. And um, he went away and then he came back again, which made me even more suspicious. And um, so then the second time I was still on the phone with my mom and um, so I was relaying to her everything that happened. Uh, so we went back to his car after the second time and I walked around to the front of my house uh, on the inside to uh, see where he was walking to and there was a car backed into our driveway. And um, so I took note of the make model license uh, of the car and um, as I was doing that I heard the garage door opening and my parents pulled up at the same exact time. And um, so the car that they were in took off and uh, my parents' car uh, went after them. And still on the phone with my mom, I said, hey, this is the, uh, this is what the car looks like. This is the, um, the license plate number. And she relayed what she had seen back to me and it was the same car that they were following. And uh, so then my dad, who was driving the car, came home and called the police. Which eventually led to the arrest of the individuals um, because that information was provided to the police and then they were able to follow up in an unmarked capacity, watch and observe as those subjects did the same MO that they had been operating with and had been hitting several places around the valley. If you're interested in the Explorer program, you can contact me at my desk phone number at 623-930-3226 or you can email us at explorers at glendaleaz.com.